Oh yeah, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the stage, homies. Let's turn this. Down. We got part two of part two of here. Uh, I wanted to turn this down, you know. But then I hear that other sound that we never fixed yet. Damn, you know, maybe I should come back after I fix that because it can't be too hard to fix. You know, maybe I'll just bypass that whole thing right there and we won't get any of that noise. All right, so I'm gonna try real quickly. Please bear with me. And um, I mean, this is not the ideal way to do it, but we will do it here. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Check, check. Check, check, check. from this microphone I bet I bet that's where the whole issue was coming from man damn what a noisy ass mic though you know I was gonna sit back here uh relax what to do man what to do when they come for you all right, so let's take some beers, man, before this shit gets warm. All right, so we totally bypassed that shit now. But now we got some other noise we got to work on. So what's up, man? Apologize, I'd be late to the party. Let 
But maybe it's because I got the gain. One, two, three. Oh, that's a little bit better, but. Check, check, one. <clears throat> check, one. You know, still, homie. Still. La, la, la. What to do, man? We ain't got a noisy wire system. Damn, yo. Sometime we're going to have to come back in here and uh, redo it all once again. But this is this is a damn noisy mic. Is it my mic or is it... Is it this button here? So let me unplug it. I mean, yeah, it's how the better with number two on. So we'll just. Oh, shit. Listen to all that noise now. Huh. Well, this is what you get, man. Let me see if. Oh, my power's not on. Check, check. Holy crap. What to do, homie? What you gonna do when they come for you? I guess it's just, uh... Noisy priest said, have an ass. Something, yo. We got something. All right. You know, but we ain't gonna worry about it, Holmes. Hell no. Hell no. We ain't gonna worry about it. Damn, look at this EQ setup right here. It's just so. F Can I say it? Can I? S I swear to God, man, these stupid ass cameras better work. Or I'm gonna get triggered up in this bitch. You know, I've been messing with this shit for damn near three hours, and God is definitely not on my side today. We got ghost in the machine. We got ghosts in the wires. All right, let's try this. Hopefully that works. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, so we are drinking dog bite. High gravity lager. My beautiful wife gave this to me. Number one fan. And I was working on a new release. You may have heard it already. On one of the streams below. But when we're done here today, my fans will have the pleasure listening to 11 hours that I can't listen to myself how do we get ourselves here bro I wanted to push the limits to see how far we could go well personally I think the limits have been hit with this mixing and we need to do something else because after a while, I mean, it's good stuff. Don't get me wrong, but uh, it could be better. And all of those tracks are needing editing. So like choruses and removed, removing all the bad, you know, how it goes. So I'm not really impressed with it, but we have 11 new hours for you. And you'll hear it 
if you want. But right now we're drinking dog bite. Bite your ass, man. And we're smoking. Just refilled this earlier today when I'm laying in bed doing the 11 hours. So what about Trump, though, and his weekly speech of injecting disinfectant? That's what we heard. But in his head, it was UV lighting. I'm not sure why he just didn't say UV lighting, because that is a disinfectant. And where is the virus? Does it chill in one spot? That might be where the UV lighting would come in. But if it's flowing through your blood, maybe you could make a UV lighting on top of blood. But would that kill all the live things in the blood? You know, like on vacuum cleaners, how they got the little UV light and, and it kills germs. So what if they did the same thing to your blood? hook you up to a, a blood machine and it cycles through but in one area they got an add-on to add UV to your light or, or to your would that kill it maybe Trump should talk about that issue tomorrow because holy crap I thought I was bad a month ago when we were suggesting that some random Facebooker put out Eat a Lysol Wipe. I even made a song about it. I'm sure you guys heard about it. But I reversed all that. So you couldn't hear Lysol Wipe. Oh uh, no, Trump. Trump doesn't need any reversing. He just goes up there and says it, homie. And then asks questions to the already humiliated old ass lady. Trying to do her job. She looks like, ah, oh, please, just get me out of here. It's like she's ready to go home and eat her salad. And, yo, hail Trump. He's got a plane, homie. You can't say shit about Trump because he owns a plane. Hey, you know, none of you do. None of the runner-up candidate. And that's why I'm voting for Trump because he got the plane. That's it. That's your only qualification, is got a plane. And then, you know, I'm just turning the cheek like Christians do. I'm a believe in what the father of the country says. If he says I should inject disinfectant because I got two brain cells and don't know how to read correctly dyslexic you know that I didn't read the whole statement all I seen was inject disinfectant those are the only two words I know of my vocabulary I don't know nothing else I might go to Walgreens and pick up a syringe and some Clorox bleach homie I don't know what a UV lighting is. I don't know all that talk. But I do know what disinfectant is because my mommy uses it to clean my diapers because I poop my pants. And it definitely needs disinfectant. So I know all about disinfectant and what it can do to poopy pants. But homie says inject it, man. Oh, and then we got this character from Las Vegas homie that is corruption because you got the governor 
of Nevada say, nah, you know, she's she doesn't know what she's doing. But then the mayor in Las Vegas is chilling around a bunch of multi-billion dollar businesses that are waiting. And it's up to her. You stick a flip the switch. Multi-billion businesses. Flipping the switch. Surely she would get one cent. At least one cent. If she could persuade everyone in the country to turn on Las Vegas. She don't care. She was there herself. She ain't going there and pushing no buttons. She's a mother. And she's worried about people's well-being if they can't afford food. But, I mean, yo, I would probably do that too, man. If you came up here and said, yo, here's a a $500,000 mixer, a gift, surely I would say something good about it. Surely I wouldn't badmouth all of the people who support me. But, you know, what are they getting out of it? Sending me a free $500,000 mixer for my voice and two other tracks for me to try out with with my 50 million subscriber list. Surely there's got to be something. Why they doing this? Show oh, out wow, the kindness of their heart. I hear he's a new mixer. I was hearing some sound. And, Yo, try this, homie. They ain't calling me homie. You're only calling me homie if I'd be like, yo, this this is the baddest, uh, this is the best mixer ever. And if you were to send me the crappiest mixer alive, I would still give you a five-star review, man. I would give you a hundred straight up, and I would tell people to buy it. Because why? Las Vegas lady and I are into millions we got our uh, we know business better than you so you could take your nice ass interview and all the many years i watched your cute ass and twirled my fat clitoris to your face uh out of here and you know two peas in a pod what can i say so Las Vegas needs to be open up. I don't know what they talking about, man. Because I'm sure if I can get all of my 50 million subscribers to sign the petition, maybe I can get the million dollars check from the casino. Wouldn't you guys like that money? Surely there's got to be some free play out of this. Yo, I was the reason why Las Vegas is open. Surely they will praise me with free food, free buffet. Uh, I mean, what mayor wouldn't do that? Tell me, what mayor? Not governor, mayor. That's that's an obvious thing of what a mayor should say. Because blind cock sucker. Giant cock sucker to get free tokens. That's my take on it. Besides that, I mean, Trump owns a plane and she's the damn mayor of Las Vegas. You can't hate me for supporting them. My girl wants to go to Las Vegas, and so do I. Who are you to say I can't go? This is the United States of America, and people have a right to work. Who the hell are you? I mean, there is no such thing as COVID-19 to any insurance company. You try to file a claim for pandemic insurance, and they will reply with, SARS and all this but since COVID-19 is an unidentified fake news man it's fake news all of us you know Trump the lady from Nevada we're the only smart people alive man 
Everyone else is stupid. For real, like, you need to take your ass back to the unemployment line if you're that desperate. I mean, that's why we got the position we in, because we ballos. Ballo material. I ain't gonna exchange my rims to give you a sandwich. Are you crazy? Why don't you go shine my rims before I give you five cents? That, that's a boss mentality, homie. Bosses. You don't think like that. Bosses. The mayor of Las Vegas. Bosses. Donald Trump with his billions of dollars. And his 707 jet. 727 jet. That none of you got. None of you are a mayor. None of you have the power to flip his. Y'all just jealous and mad. You can't go out to the beach. And provide service for yourself nope I mean I think injecting a um, my response I think if there's a way to it inject disinfect it we need to figure out a way we need to do some testing because I believe Trump is on to something. All you illiterates. He never said Clorox bleach. He never said Lysol, you idiots. He never said anything like cleaning supplies, you dumbasses. He said UV light go inside of your skin to the infected issue. That's what geniuses are talking about. And if you can't follow along fake ass news... Maybe you shouldn't be invited to this conference anyway, since you're all bad news. You can't say nothing good about us. We're number one. I, I really, you know, you, you, you're just cock blocking. Yeah, and I think Trump is right. You know, flipping his channel at 9 a.m. watching Kumo. Kumo was overrated for show. I was watching it. We need like 400,000 beds. And there's like two people in a hospital. Two. In that big ass Navy, Navy ship. It's got no one on it. Guy's a joke, man. He doesn't know what he's doing. He should get fired. Just like the governor of Nevada. Because it's unconstitutional to behave. You know, stop acting socialist and communist. If I want to play my slot machine, bitch, let me play my slot machine. Because I'm working for my free drink. The hell's wrong with you? This is America, wide ass. I was patient. Not anymore. I put my hand up. For a taxi. Because I'm getting my ass out of here, bro. Put my hand up and I'm summoned. Summoned. My car. I'll be here in three, two, one, and you get mad because you ain't know what summons is. Only words you know are injecting disinfectant. Yo, uh, it speaks for itself. The kings rise. Queens will sing. The legend's name. Money will always rule the world and all you money haters who don't want anyone to work and all you government cheese takers are pathetic. Bunch of scary ass individuals who ain't got nothing better to do. And that's what I'm saying, man. This world, we got a new beginning and people still ain't happy. Jesus came back 
and he he washed away all the crime. Crime has dropped twenty percent, basically all areas. And you know, y'all still ain't happy. Y'all like y'all give me food like a little cheap cheap, waiting for that worm to be fed in your mouth. It's that that government worm. No, you you looking at waiting for a dick? What you're looking for? Looking for a way out. The sad thing is, welcome to reality. Trump, 2020, 2021, 22. How many of these years been flying by with the good old guy in office? I've been too busy staring at his jet and his nice haircut that I just forgot to set my alarm clock and got high cause damn Trump's the man look at Warren bitch where's where's she at now man where is she at eating pizza That's where she's at. She ain't fighting for you anymore. She's a damn liar. Trump is the only one we can. The great white hope. Y'all better recognize that the rapture already happened. And this is a new beginning. Boop. How does that make you feel? That it wasn't what you thought it was. Life is different. I think everyone will agree to this new normal. I just can't get a grasp of it, so let me uh, put a gun to my head. Oh, Lord, because I can't do it. Can't do it anymore, man. All I'm good at is scooping shit in a pig pen. That's all I know how to do for the last 300 years. And by golly, there ain't no pigs left, so I ain't got no skills. I got nothing, man. I'm a hard-working labor person. Please, please, boss of construction, please hire me so I can feed my 50 kids. Please, please. That was your little sob-ass story, bro. Stop watching TV all day, homie. You make me sick. Men are supposed to be out there working like me right now. I'm working my ass off. What about you? You've been on vacation for the past two months. How does that make me feel? I need to vomit all over this microphone and then re-say it. You know, I only drank like this much. <sighs> All right, so let's, uh, ah, uh, damn it, yo. I didn't check. Starting to have a hot flash. How many hoes out there? Got stinky pussy right now. Let's see a raise of a hands. Don't be shy. 